Hello everybody and welcome to Pez Plays. This time we're playing some Sonic Generations. This game is freaking amazing. I I realize I kind of say that about every game we play, but this one seriously is now my favorite game ever. It's so good. I really love the Sonic games, especially the 3D ones. I mean, well, we're not really playing one of the 3D ones yet, but it's 3D cl classic Sonic. Classic Sonic is pretty fun too. But um, yeah, this is pretty much going to replace the Transformers or for Cybertron. Let's play because, well, it was just generally really bad. Oh jeez. Yeah, now it's gonna be this game. Super fun. It's all brightly colored and everything, so it's a lot different from other games we've done. Cause like the Tasmanian Tiger and uh, Gunman Clive were kind of uh, most of the time they all have the same colors throughout the whole entire levels. This one, it's all bright and shiny and new and awesome. The uh, reason I had, would, didn't upload this earlier, I was planning to do this for a while, because it's such a fun game and I wanted to share it with you guys. But I uh, wasn't able to because I had to figure out graphic settings and all that for... Um, every time I tried recording it... Um, with the software I was using before, it would lag tremendously to the point where I couldn't do anything at all, and it looked horrible. So I, oh come on! So I had to mess around with settings on everything to make it work. But it works now, so yay! Now we're rolling around at the speed of sound. Got places to go. Got to follow my rainbow. And oh, crabs! This game you play as both a uh, classic and modern Sonic. Like we're on a classic stage now, and you can tell like it's like a 3D version of like you know Sonic the Hedgehog, like the original one from like the old games, like Sonic the Hedgehog one, two, and Sonic and Knuckles, those those games. But you also play as um, the modern Sonic, such as the ones from uh, Sonic Adventure. The Sonic Adventure games, Sonic Unleashed, Sonic 06, those kinds of games. And yes, there are parts of it which resemble Sonic 06, but don't worry about that. It's it's not as bad. It's much, much better. This also seems um, to be the only Sonic game where I can get um, A and S ranks. That probably just means I'm bad at the other games, like uh, on Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, I'd always get like horrible ranks like C and D. I can never get an S or an A rank. Probably shouldn't be talking over the awesome cutscenes. He'll be here any second. Hey guys, what's going on? You having a party or something? Surprise! Ah, <laughs> you guys. It's kind of impossible to surprise you. You totally got me this time. I had no idea. Yeah, right. Happy birthday, Sonic. Hope you like this. Like it? I love it!
am I? So, anyways, I was talking about how, um... Well, first of all, now we're playing as uh, class or modern Sonic now. As you can see, he's like a taller, darker blue. Yeah, older and everything. But, um, like how I was saying, I was criticizing the other games for being so monochrome. And the main hub to this game is literally just a white abyss. Yeah, let's get started in this one. Also, it's kind of weird because I'm using um, a keyboard for the controls on this. It's a lot easier to play with on um, controllers, but I've completely broken my Xbox controller now. It's not just the A button. None of the buttons work anymore. So, yeah. Oh. Let's not do that. So, as you can see now, it's a lot more like the... Um, uh, old modern Sonic games. Like, uh, it takes a lot from Unleashed, I think. I don't know, I've never really played Unleashed. I want to, it looks it looks fun, everybody's... I think I'm, I, I keep hearing mixed reviews on it, between whether it's like really good or really, really bad. <clears throat> this is also one of the games where Tails isn't completely annoying. I, I, like, I think I, I actually like the voice actor on this one. It's not as bad as some of the previous games. So you can pull off tricks like this when you get in midair. I don't know if that's from any of the other games too. I've only really played um, the adventure games. I've never actually played any of the other 3D Sonics. Come on, jump, jump to the side. Okay. Run away from the giant Magikarp robot. Woo! So awesome! Running. Okay, that was horrible failure. Boo! And they're off again! So fast! You can get to pretty high speeds in this game, it's awesome! Ah, I didn't get to finish that one. Go for the spikes! A lot of jumping around. Jumping around at the speed of sound. Phew! You also see it like, uh... Switches around between uh, 2D and 3D. When the... Oh gosh, what just happened? Okay, sometimes you can really mess up the camera in, the, in Modern Sonic. Because you can go so fast in this. That the camera just can't keep up at all. Yeah, like this. Just look how fast he's going. It's ridiculous. Also, look how beautiful this level is. It's so good. Like I was saying with all the colors, it's so bright and vivid. And we're finished! Woohoo! Yeah! Perfect! S rank. This does seem a lot shorter than the adventure levels, just because you go so freaking fast. Like in the other ones, it's more platformy. I mean, I'm not saying that this one isn't, but those ones are more... Thanks, Sonic. Uh, I thought I was dead. Less fast. A body in a black limbo. <sighs> I'm gonna that is really dark, actually. That's really disturbing. Is it me? Or is that place we were just in awfully familiar? Mm, not to me, but this place looks like something sucked all the life and color out of it. It oh, still didn't strange. come in until... We're no stranger than Ooh. rescuing genies in magic books or saving aliens in an interstellar amusement park. I'm more concerned... Oh, the references. Friends. Hey, Sonic, I saw something over there in the distance. Like buildings, but they look weird. That might be a good place to check out. I'll be back soon.
Well, you weren't kidding when you said soon. I thought you already left. Alright, so every time we complete a level, um, every level has two acts to it, which means, um, yeah, we can switch between uh, Modern and Classic Sonic now. So Green Hill Zone will have two different acts, so we've already completed, uh, oh, yep, 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 that's what I'm explaining. So yeah, we got Green Hill Zone Act 2, and the Act 2 would be Modern Sonic, but we can switch to Classic Sonic to go into Act 1 over here this place will also have two acts um, so we can play as either modern or classic Sonic but we will save that for next time on Pez Plays we'll head down head out into these weird buildings which if you've played some of the old Sonics you'll know exactly what this is immediately but yeah don't go floating into any deep abysses like Tails see you next time on Pez Plays